It was the Pennsylvania Senate debate watched around the country tonight. Republican Mehmet Oz and Democrat John Fetterman in the only debate of a race that could determine which party controls the U.S. Senate. Good evening. I'm Lori Burkholder. And I'm Jerry Gish. The race has been getting tighter in recent weeks, and this debate was also unique with the use of closed captioning on the stage. Let's go to Barbara Barr. She's been covering this race. She's at that debate tonight. Barb? Lori and Jerry, this was a contentious debate at times with each candidate claiming the other was lying about some of his positions that they took during the debate. Neither seemed to land a real knockout punch in this very close race. John Fetterman did use closed captioning following that stroke. And while he did stumble over words, he addressed the issues and questions that he was asked. Now, this debate coming just two weeks now before the election, the stakes incredibly high. It is one of the races that could decide the balance of power in the United States Senate. Recent polls show a very tight race within the margin of error, just a couple of points separating the candidates. They debated issues from the economy to crime to abortion and education. Both dodged questions at times, and both were asked about contradictory opinions they once offered on the issue of fracking. I've been very consistent. Fracking has been demonstrated. It's a very old technology to be safe. Uh, it is a lifeline for this Commonwealth to be able to build wealth, similar to what they've been able to achieve in other states. For that reason, I strongly support fracking. I, I've, I've always supported fracking, and I always believe that independence with our energy is, is critical. We can't be held you know, you know, ransom to somebody like Russia. And John Fetterman said uh, he would not commit to releasing his full medical records. He released a note from his doctor saying he was capable of fulfilling duties, but did say the fact that he was here at the debate was transparency enough. We'll have more on the issues these two candidates debated as once again the election just two weeks away now, that all-important election. Live in Harrisburg, Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.